guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Crystal and today, today I know you guys are going to enjoy this video because I have a beauty haul for you guys. I haven't done a beauty haul in a while and I have a lot of exciting stuff for you guys. If you guys are interested in seeing what I got, then just keep on watching. This is going to be a lot of makeup. I have only one product from Miniso and everything else I got online. First thing that I got is this Miniso Makeup Puff Assortment. So this is the only thing that I got in real life, the rest I got from online sellers. So um, the first thing that I got is are these adorable sponges and it's uh, it has a pink panther theme. I thought these sponges were adorable. So when I entered Miniso, I saw like there's this pink area there and it has a pink panther theme going on there and I thought that was really cute. So it has this baby pink um, sponges which is the color of pink panther and I think that this is a really nice and fun idea and I asked the sales lady there if these sponges grow when they're wet she said no it doesn't grow it just stays like this small and I tried to touch the sponges there and listen to myself and actually it's very similar to the sponges that I have that bubble in size when it's wet so I just listened to myself and I got it and I returned home. I tried to wet it and it actually grew and doubled in size. So if you guys ever encounter a sponge from Miniso, they do double in size when it's wet. Okay, now moving on to the fun part of this video. You guys know that I've been ordering my um, palettes from Shopee lately. The makeup products that I order are usually available from AliExpress but I think that it's more difficult to order from AliExpress than Shopee. It's a lot easier for me to order from Shopee because they do cash on delivery. And you can pay right in front of your doorstep. I have a bunch of makeup products to try for you guys. By the way, I'll put everything in the description box down below. The seller info, the product info, price list and everything else. So you guys can check it out there if you guys are interested in buying these products. I ordered this from apink.ph so that is the seller name um, on Shopee so they are a seller from China so, and they do ship their products in the Philippines and it takes for about and the shipping fee is 120 but I ordered something more than 1000 pesos so I think that's why it's free shipping. So this is called the power remover sponge brush tool quick wash brush cleaner. So that is actually a long name. So this is how it looks like. This is actually a brush cleaner and if you're lazy to wash your brush and you just want to quickly change the color of your eyeshadow, you just want to quickly remove the shadow from your um, brush and use it for another color, then this is the product to use. So swirl your brush in and um, most of the color will be removed from the brush and you can use it directly for another color and use it on your eyes. So it's like, this is very convenient if you are a makeup artist or if you're just like me, you're doing your makeup every day and you don't wanna use like four or more brushes, you just wanna use one brush, this is perfect for that. I haven't done a review on this, but I will very soon. So I have a lot of products to review for you guys. I'm definitely going to do a review on this anytime soon. Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you guys, so, this, so all of these arrived inside this bubble wrap. This bubble wrap is actually very thick and it's perfect for makeup palettes, being everything very safe and secure. It reminds me a lot of those floaters that you use for the beach. It's very, very high quality bubble wrap. So uh, A plus for that, for the packaging. I really love it. So um, none of my products came broken. Okay, so now moving on to the next product, I got uh, actually got uh, two lipsticks. Um, so this is the Miss Rose Professional Makeup Lipstick Matte with Vitamin E. So this is how it looks like. So I just ordered a what's this cherry red color. This is in the shade. What's this? Um, hold on, I don't know what shade this. Oh yeah, 35 Passion. So this is a 35 Passion. Oh my god, the packaging is so nice. I really like the packaging. It's a matte red color, and the color goes. The packaging goes well with the color. It's red. I think the other one is nude, and the packaging is nude as well. So um, it smells very sweet, like candy. It's supposed to be a matte um, lipstick. So let me just give you guys a swatch. 
Um, well, yeah, I'm not really sure if this is a matte lipstick, but it feels like a matte lipstick. The packaging. Oh yeah, it's a matte lipstick, but it's very moisturizing on my hand. As you can see, it has a sheen, but um, I think on the lips, it's going to look um, slightly matte, I think. The lips really need a little bit of moisture in it, even though it's a matte lipstick. So I can't wait to try this and do a review. So the next color that I got is 39 Mus. So M-U-S-S. So this is a nude shade. The packaging is completely matte and it just has a gold font. And you can see the brand name here, Miss Rose. And the shade name on the back. And this is just a like orangey nude color. You guys know that I really like orangey nude colors. So this one is kind of like orangey um, brownish nude color. Oh my gosh, I love this color. And I'm not really a fan of red, but I just decided to order a red color just in case I need it. But oh my gosh, this color is just amazing. This is completely the color that I always wear orangey nude so that is the color and i can't wait to wear this now let's move on to two highlighters that i got so these actually remind me a lot of the pat mcgrath products because they came in a box with stars in it so you guys know that the pat, pat mcgrath um, eyeshadow sometimes come in a packaging like this so there's like stars inside can you see that? Oh my god, that's just so adorable, I think. And I got the shade number one and number five. So this is by Tia Son. And it's a liquid highlighter. So um, I'm going to save this for another review. And I'm actually going to do a separate review for all of these because I think that it's more fun like that. You'll be able to um, get to know each of these products more clearly if I'm going to do a separate review. So this one is actually similar to a unicorn highlighter because it's a purpley, um, pearly purple um, highlight. It's like a white highlight with a purple shift. So I can't wait to try this one. So yeah, it's like a unicorn or holographic highlight and you guys know I'm into it. And this one is just a pink highlight with a gold shift to it. So I don't know if you can see that, but I can't wait to try these as well. So the next product is a foundation. It's by Miss Rose and it's the same brand as these lipsticks. It's Miss Rose Matte Wear Liquid Foundation. I'm actually wearing this foundation right now. I already did a review and first impression on this and it should be up before this video. And it's actually in a squeezy tube bottle like this one. I think that sometimes I'm into simple packaging. I know that I always say I'm a sucker for packaging, but sometimes I'm really into simple packaging like this. So um, this is a matte foundation. Just watch my first impression on this if you guys want this. So this is actually a very, very affordable foundation. So this is a tiny dot on my hand and I'm going to show you guys that it's not a liquid foundation. It's actually a moussey or like creamy foundation. So the next product is actually a glitter glue. So this is a glitter glue. It's called a Dragon Rani. Rani. Dragon Rani. And I got three pieces of this. So if you guys are a fan of glitter if you have a glitter collection if you're into like loose pigments you can definitely use this one and oh my god i'm so in love with this one because um it really works well for um, loose glitters it's a very very thin texture but it dries tacky and you can use this as a glitter primer or your it's not an eyeshadow primer definitely it's not it's definitely not a eyelash glue it has a very very thin consistency i'm sorry if you can hear the poppy outside so you can use this as a mixing medium for your glitters for your pigments and the way i use it is i apply a bit of this on the back of my hand then i scoop some glitter loose glitters um then i mix it with um, the um, glitter glue and I apply it on my eyelids or you can use this um, as an eyeliner like a glitter liner you can mix your own um, a glitter liner or um, glitter eyeshadow for this and your glitters will just really stick on this one so I highly recommend this and this is super cheap you guys so this is 75 pesos for a pack of three that is just super super affordable and you can't really find 
glitter glue anywhere. So the next thing that I got is this ever-changing eyeshadow palette by Folklore. And I've been using Folklore and I'm a fan of their eyeshadow palettes. I think that their eyeshadow palettes are just amazing. They're one of the most um, fantastic eyeshadow palettes. How the ever-changing palette looks like and um, when you open it so this reminds me a lot of a Kylie um, cosmetics eyeshadow palette I think and it always comes with a clear protective um, plastic on top and this is how the eyeshadows look like and it's again it's a mixture of shimmery and matte eyeshadows and I can't wait to play around with this palette and so it's a neutral palette with a pop of blue and purple so I can't wait to play around with this palette and make a first impression review. And the next thing that I got is this um, Kiao Yan, Kiao Yan China The Nudes Palette. And it reminds you of the Maybelline The Nudes Palette. I think that's what it's called but it's like the uh, Maybelline Nude Palette which is in a very very similar packaging with this one. This is a 12 color uh, nudes eyeshadow palette so this one reminds me a lot of the Maybelline eyeshadow palette and this is actually very very affordable and everything that I got are very affordable I've seen a lot of reviews of this on YouTube so uh, it's time for me to try this so the next palette that I got is by eye magic and I got the eye magic flash palette before which is a dupe for the makeup forever flash palette I tried the eye magic liquid lipstick I tried the eye magic flash palette which is my first time to try an eyeshadow palette from eye magic and this is the brand name eye magic professional cosmetics so it's this is a 16 color eyeshadow palette and it has 28.8 grams inside. So it comes in this really luxurious gold palette. And I really like the packaging. And uh, I think that it's really classy and elegant. I really like this one. The colors really caught my attention. And those are the colors. Looking at it, I think that they are pigmented because uh, I saw some swatches online and these swatches were beautiful. That's why I got this. And, um, oh my gosh, there's just a tiny bit of eyeshadow that was um, on the packaging and I tried to swatch it and oh my god, that is so intense. Oh my god, I can imagine how like a full swatch will look on my skin. That is just a tiny little drop of eyeshadow and I tried to swatch it and it looks so pigmented. So I can't wait to try these eyeshadows. But it has four foiled eyeshadows. So I really like that it has a night size mirror like this. And if you have your neutrals here. So this is one of those all-in-one eyeshadow palettes because you have your shimmery colors here. You have four foiled eyeshadows. You need to have your transition colors. It has a very nice transition color here. And if you want to smoke up your look, you have your two matte shades here two matte dark shades here this is a very dark brown shade and this is a very very jet black color and i like that all the colors have names so it's easier to use for tutorials so the next thing that i got is a liquid eyeshadow and this is in the shade 04 it came in a silver box like this and i don't really understand um what's written on the back but this is by the brand Hang Fam and it reminds me a lot of the Stila liquid metals. I think that's what it's called. But this is how it looks like and doesn't it remind you a lot of the Stila um, liquid metals? Is that what it's called? The liquid metallic eyeshadows by Stila and I think that it reminds me a lot of that. So this is how the um, liquid eyeshadow looks like. I really like that it has a lot of gold specks of glitters in it wow that is so creamy super pigmented it looks really opaque so i'm going to show you guys this watch and, and that is so metallic okay that is a close-up that is so metallic and opaque that is just one swipe so i can't wait to use this for my eyes and i wish i can compare this with the stila uh, uh, liquid eyeshadows. I forgot what it's called, but it's um, a liquid eyeshadow by Stila. But um, oh my gosh, that is pretty. This one comes in a lot of different shades, 
but I got I just got the shade um, 04 so of course I'm so excited to try this one as well so the next thing that I got is a dupe for the Anastasia Beverly Hills Aurora palettes it is in a holographic packaging which I'm so into the packaging is so cool it's holographic just like the um, Anastasia Beverly Hills one and they have a dupe for the Moonchild palette as well but I didn't get that a metallic powder highlighters for intense luminosity so I think that the palette is so pretty and I saw the swatches online but I'm not really sure if you swatch it in real life and apply it on your cheeks I can't swatch this yet because I'm planning to do a first impression on this one as well so I'm actually going to do a first impression on most of these products so um, but these are the colors. They are so pretty. I'm excited for this shade called Helia and this one called Luna and Eclipse. I think they are pretty. And if I'm planning to do an out of this world makeup look, I'm going to try this shade called Orion. This one. So the last two things that I got are liquid lipstick sets. And the first set that I got is by the brand Beauty Glaze. And I did a review of their eyeshadow palettes. I absolutely love their eyeshadow palettes. I think that. This is one of those affordable brands that make amazing makeup products. So this is the Beauty Glaze Matte Liquid Lipstick. And um, it has... Hold on. So this is how the liquid lipstick looks like. So it's a set of six liquid lipsticks. So they are actually uh, mini liquid lipsticks. Like, it's set a smaller size. So let me just open this up. So you get six um, liquid lipsticks, six in one set. They're actually a lot smaller than a regular liquid lipstick. So it looks like this. So this is how a regular liquid lipstick looks like. You can see the size difference right away. Uh, this one is definitely a lot bigger. So um, it has... Hi. So it has uh, four nude colors and two uh, bright colors. And this is just a like pinkish red color, I guess. And the other one is a red, dark red color. So I really can't wait to try these liquid lipsticks as well. But like I said, I really like the brand Beauty Glaze. I think they make a lot of nice makeup products. Okay, so last but definitely not the least, I got this Color Castle um color castle castile makeup beauty so i don't really know what it's like castle castile this one so it's not really clear but um let's just say it's color castle uh, makeup beauty so um this is a set of 15 and um this is actually very affordable i got this like for i got this for like 570 or they came out with this for valentine's day but most of the time uh, the price changes it just depends on the seller but um let's say for example this one i got this for 500 plus but now it's 1500 so so i think it's just best to attach the um product and seller info in the description box in case you're interested in buying these 15 um liquid lipsticks and i actually tried two of these lipsticks already i wore i actually wore this for valentine's day and i i wore the shade um i think i wore the shade uh wait hold on you get 15 um, liquid lipsticks and it's a mixture of nude and vibrant colors. You have like a couple of nude shades here. They're mostly nude colors. It has only one dark red color and two pink colors. So uh, it's really perfect for Valentine's Day and I think it's a perfect gift set. It says here, Color Castle Makeup Beauty Double Touch Lipstick. So this will last you forever. I mean, you don't really ever finish up a liquid lipstick tube i think i never i never ever finished a liquid lipstick um example this one i've had this for like a year and i still have um full so you're gonna pull it like this and uh, so there you go so those are the liquid lipsticks and i really like the color selection because um they're all wearable but they're all different shades so it has nude pink nude orange and you have um, bright pink and bright red as well so i really think that this is an amazing set and i wore i think i wore this shade 11 for valentine's day this is a really nice 
um, color. It really dries completely matte. Yeah, it smells like chocolate. It smells like... It smell, yeah, it, it smells like anything. Fruit? Fruit? Yeah, it smells fruity. It smells like ice cream. Like, it's... It smells like black forest ice cream. What do you think? Uh, Again. It smells like black forest ice cream, I think. Mm, yeah. <laughs> it smells like black forest ice cream. No joke. Yeah, it smells like that. Like, it's a mixture of chocolate, vanilla, and cherry. So, that is exactly how I'm going to describe the scent of this. So, that is it for my beauty haul. I love, love, love doing beauty hauls for you guys. And I love shopping like every other girl out there I enjoy showing you guys what i get like i love watching beauty hauls as well i think it's really helpful if i want to buy any product like it's nice to watch somebody review it before i purchase it myself it's always more convenient to watch reviews before purchasing a product because um it saves you from buying a product that you probably won't like anyway so so that is it for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want more beauty hauls, let me know in the comment section down below. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Don't forget to click the notification bell so that your phones will be updated whenever I upload a new video. And I'll see you guys again next time.